Hi everyone, and welcome to this new tutorial on the HP Mini 110. This tutorial will show you how to replace the battery, RAM, and hard drive. So, first things first, this is how to replace the battery. It's pretty easy. You can flip the netbook around, and then there are two sliders right here. The one on the, the one on the left side is the locking, is for the lock of the battery, and the one on the right side is for actually putting the battery out. So if it's locked, you want to slide it, slide it to the left, slide this to the right. And now it's unlocked. And then with two hands, take this one, slide this one to the left, and then slide the bat battery out. Right. If you have a new battery, you can just slide it in right away, and it will just lock into place. Then you lock the slider again, and you're done. Now, onto the RAM replacement. For replacing the RAM, um, also for hard drive replacement, by the way, this is also a necessary step. Um, for placing the RAM and hard drive, you take this orange tab and you pull it to the left side. Now, you can just take the whole bottom cover off, and in my netbook, the bias battery likes to come out, so you can just quickly put that back in. All right, so here's the inside of the netbook. This right here is the RAM, so what you just do, you take it out, and you can put in new RAM, Stay, put it in like this at an angle, make sure it's in, push it down until it clicks, and your RAM is secure in place. I'm just going to take it out for the purpose of this video. If you are replacing the hard drive, you don't need to take out the RAM. Um, now on, now on to the hard drive, there's a tab right here which you can lift up, there's a screw right here, 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 and here. Alright, I'm just going to take out the screws real quick. Alright, so now that these screws are out, you can lift up this tab which reveals the tab underneath, slide that to the left, and it comes right out. This is the hard drive caddy with the with the 250 gig or 300, 320 gig hard drive inside. Um, to take this out, you just take out, there should be a screw right here, but I've already taken some of it out. So there should be a screw right here, here, you flip it around, here, and right here. Just take those screws out. All right, now that the screws are out, you can just take out the hard drive and replace it for a better one. But I have a better one, so I'm just going to keep it in. So to put it back in, just, for, just put the screws back to where they came from and it was on the side. I'm going to do this quick, quickly off camera because, well, it's the exact same as putting them in. Alright, so now that the hard drive is back in the caddy again, we want to make sure that the SATA connector, which is right here, is on the top side, where the battery should be at the battery side. And is facing to the right. And you lift up the tab once again. And you put in you slot in the hard drive and you pull this tab and it comes right into place. You can get the tab back over it again and you can screw it the hard drive caddy down. Alright, so now, now that the hard drive is back in place, um, I'm going to slot the RAM back in real quick. Alright, now that you've replaced the hard, the hard drive and or the RAM, you take the bottom cover again and you place it just up. You place it where it should go and you click it down right into place. Alright, in my case it is completely done. Uh, I'm done, I mean on. So the last thing you want to do again 
is slot in the battery. So I'm slot it in with this, with this little intake facing in the right way. And it's in. And you can just make sure that it's completely in by that way. And then you can slide the lock like that. Just make sure that everything will come out. And ta-da! You are finished. You have upgraded slash replaced the RAM, hard drive and battery in your HP Mini 110 netbook. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in a new video. Goodbye.